Yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy, and I'm back, and I got to have a real talk moment with you guys. This is going to be a state of the channel, future of the channel, but also just a me talking to you guys, man. You know, we're all part of the same crew here. It's one big family, just like the Straw Hats, and I got to be up front with you guys, right? Like, I'm, I'm having that moment where it's just like with Nico Robin, where Nico Robin went through a period and she kind of separated herself. Now, I'm not saying I'm quitting YouTube. No, that's not the case. So please don't say that. I, I, I know that when it comes to reviewing One Piece in Chapter 1, uh, you know, Jim Snurt Nation had that issue and he, you know, quit after 500 you know chapter reviews and because of different things that happened. That's not the case here. But what I have to ask you guys is you've seen the new format for the videos and you've seen... Uh, that the videos are being edited a lot closer to the Naruto and the Boruto and the uh, Dragon Ball and the Fairy Tale videos I used to do, and I think all of you guys are getting here to, you know, this uh, new new channel and to this platform. But you know the, you know, big thing that I want to ask is, as the editing is going right now, I can only upload two, maybe three chapter reviews in this new format. Now, here's the thing, if I were to take the reviews that I had already pre-recorded and I had already uploaded to the last channel before the last channel got, you know, uh, the Thanos finger snap, right? Before that happened, uh, if I were to take that and then I were to use a few thumbnails throughout the video, like four to five thumbnails that have the text over it and say one piece chapter 686 review or something. Right. And just kind of have that change in throughout the video. Would you be okay with that? With that being more of a podcast type setting than the more heavily edited stuff, the trade off on that would be is that I'd be able to get a lot more of these uh, reviews out to you guys in a more timely manner. And I got to say this, you know, like I, I got to think I'll be, you know, I'll be just gotten back on board with helping with the thumbnails and I completely appreciate it. And if I were to do this, this would actually start after he gets me the thumbnails for uh, chapter 699 because, you know, Danny uh, Luxury and uh, I'm going to edit that out have gotten me quite a few thumbnails to where I could you know start pumping out more, more videos like uh, I'm going to edit that out, you know, gave me a whole volumes worth of uh, of, uh, uh, of pictures to use. And, you know, Danny Luxury has given me a few volumes worth of, of pictures to use. So, I mean, both of these guys have helped out tremendously. Albie has been helping for the longest period of time. And I got to thank them before I thank anybody else. Now, for everybody else, I do have to thank you for your support, for helping me during this trying time because you know, of what happened in the beginning of the year, you know, I, I went through quite a trying period, but there are other things that have happened. And part of the reason why I only upload, you know, two times here and part of the reason why I only upload two times on the other channel is because of what happened earlier in this year. And then because I lost the YouTube channel and I'm going to be blunt with you guys, like I was uh, helping a relative pay their mortgage using that channel. My mom's uh, business was being sued. I was in talks to assume her mortgage. The, I work for a politician and there was a lot of talk that the politician that you know took over my office was going to fire everybody from last administration because they are from a, a different party. And so I had a lot going on and my stress level never really came down from where it was in the beginning of the year when I was going through that miniature depression that was going through really it was a depression but you know the stress level never uh, went down and it's just it was just one thing after another and when you look at what's going on uh now like you know if you guys are following me on twitter you know that like my grandma she's 80 years old she her spinal cord and everything is so fucked up right now to where they need to do surgery and if they don't do the surgery, there's a chance she might not walk again. But the problem is my grandma is 80 years old. If they do the surgery, she might not wake up. And so it's a bunch of things that are going on. And, you know, the big thing was you know, at some point I was going to have to assume my mom's mortgage in order to keep her from losing the house because that land has been in my family for over 100 years. And so I had a lot going on. 
and my stress levels had gotten to the point where my blood pressure rose so high that it wasn't, oh, you've got stage one hypertension. No, it was, no, you need to take your ass to the emergency room. And my weight had blown up. And you guys really didn't get a chance to see that because I pre-recorded so many videos back in 2017. I pre-recorded so much stuff that you saw me when I was still in you know peak physical condition, right? Like you saw me when I was at my best. You saw me when I was weighing in the 240s and I had 11.5% body fat and I was pretty thick, but it was muscle. And, you know, since then I've gained over 40 pounds and it's because when I go through depression and I go through as much as I've gone through this year, I'm an emotional eater and it, it just led to a lot. Like I, I hit that. I don't give a fuck stage. I really hit it hard. You know, I ate a bunch of shit that I didn't need to eat. I was drinking a lot. You know, I just had, a, I don't give a fuck. You know, I would go weeks without cutting my hair. You know, I was growing, you know, the beard and scruffy and everything. I just didn't give a fuck. And it got to a point where I was buying new clothes every six weeks because I was gaining weight that rapidly. And what I wanted to say is that, you know, I have been working and getting myself under control, but that's why I haven't been uploading as much. But I have enough of a control over what's going on with my body and with my health to the point where, you know, if you guys are okay with me doing like the podcast type setting for these one piece reviews, I can crank them out a lot faster and I can get the older reviews up as well over time. And when we catch up, when we catch up to the current chapters that we have uh, in one piece, I think right now, like we're at chapter like nine twenty three or something like we're really high. It's my hope to be caught up with one piece before we get to chapter nine sixty. And if that were to happen, if you guys were okay with it, then when we got those One Piece reviews, then those reviews for the current chapter will be very heavily edited, like the ones that I was doing when I first launched this channel uh, a couple months ago. Those reviews would be heavily edited like that. The discussion videos, the thumbnails that I'll be, and I'm edit that out, and uh, Danny Luxury and Lone Wolf, the thumbnails that were being sent to me, I would be taking those and those images and I'll be doing a lot of the one piece discussions and you begin the one piece discussion uh, twice out the week and you begin the chapter review. So I will be doing heavily edited stuff, but for right now, I just want to kind of catch up on one piece, but I just want to make sure that's okay with you guys and that you guys would actually support that. So let me know down in the comment section below what were your thoughts on this and you know, whether or not it's a yay or a nay, I would love to do a community tab for this. But right now, I don't have access to the community tab on this channel, so I can't really do that. But once again, guys, thank you so much for your support. You have no idea. You know, I know the Naruto channel is bigger, but, you know, this One Piece channel and just the One Piece reviews, you know, when I was first starting on the old platform, you know, like the where I would get the most comments for a very long time was on the One Piece chapter reviews and you know there was a great community there. There was a lot of a lot of love. There was some, you know, trolling on my part about the Nico Robin and Nami stuff. And you know, I found out a lot about the community. I didn't know that Sanji and Zoro had a uh beef like they do as far as in the fandom. Like it, it was just so great. And this channel, this community has such a soft spot in my heart. And it's my hope that when I catch up that I can grow it even bigger than the Naruto stuff. I know it's because I'm reviewing one piece from chapter one. There's not really a market for that. It'd be easier if I was reacting to the anime or something, but that's not what I'm going to do. I mean, that, that is playing with copyright strikes and, you know, YouTube is, you know, really, really fickle. Maybe if I had a network, then I would run that risk. But, you know, once again, guys, thank you so much for your support. Have a great day, guys. <laughs>